Hi, I'd like to show you the cruise control system I designed using an Arduino for my car, a 2003 Nissan Micra. As you can see, it's embedded into, the f into this little box in the front panel. The interface is quite simple. You've got a switch to turn it on. Then the screen lights up. You can see the current speed of the car the target speed of the cruise control and CC off meaning that the cruise control is off. Then we've got two buttons. With the yellow button we can turn the cruise control on to the current speed of the car. So if I press it the target speed goes to zero because it's the current speed of the car. I can press it again to turn it off. With that knob I can turn the target speed up and down so for example, I can put a target speed of 90 km per hour and then with the green button I can turn the cruise control on to the target speed. Because the car is not in gear, it will just accelerate but it will not move, of course. So, now I'm going to show you um, a demonstration of how it actually performs on the road and then I'll show you the internals. As you can see here I'm driving my car on the highway. The cruise control is set at a speed of 120 km per hour and it's holding it quite fine. I'm not touching the pedals and it's holding the speed. This system is far from perfect because the Arduino has access only to the speed of the car. Ideally it should also have a reading of the engine torque in order to better detect changes of the slope of the road. The very limited 65 horsepower of this car doesn't help either. Nevertheless, when the road is decently flat, it can hold the speed quite well. Now I'm going to show you the internals of the system. This front panel is attached with, a, with Velcro, so it's easy to remove. On the back we can see the connections for the for the screen and the buttons and everything and this attaches to the custom made PCB so we've got here the screen connector the front panel buttons connector then we've got the power switch connector this is the power uh, line that actually attaches to the radio power line of the car. Then we've got this cable that goes to the front left wheel sensor to detect the speed of the car. And then we've got these five cables that go to the two accelerator pedal position sensors and the brake pedal sensor. So, how does it work? Well, the Arduino can read the speed of the car from the uh, wheel sensor. The wheel sensor signal is sent into a comparator to adapt the signal into the input range of the Arduino. And then the Arduino basically counts the pulses and knows the speed of the car. When the cruise control is not engaged, then those two pairs of blue cables are just connected to each other via this relay. So the signal that's being sent from the accelerator pedal is sent directly through this board to the ECU of the car, so nothing changes. When the cruise control system is on, then the Arduino sends a signal to the relay, the relay disconnects the accelerator pedal position sensors from the ECU 
and starts supplying its own signal to the ECU. So it's actually tricking the car uh, electrical control unit into thinking that the actual pedal is being pushed and released. So the Arduino cannot output an analog signal. So the, the Arduino outputs a PWM signal. The PWM signal is being converted into an actual analog signal uh, with a two-stage low-pass filter with those two and those two capacitors and four resistors and this analog signal is supplied at the same time to, the bo to both inputs of the both uh, accelerator pedal position sensors because the, uh, the pedal actually has two sensors those two sensors have to supply a valid signal at the same time Otherwise, the check engine line will pop out. So, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, you can ask them, and I'll be more than happy to answer them. And maybe I'll post something else in the future.